What's going on guys? It's your boy DPJ here today for another Destiny video and today I bring you Zer's Loot Stash for the 1st of July 2016. Now I've woke up extra early to do this video so the motherfucker better have got something good and my thought is as so as hell so if I sound a little off that's why. Now let's just see what this beast has got. Um, now to be honest there's actually nothing I think I need. Um, three of coins is about it. Oh okay so oh 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 Okay, so we've got the Twilight Garrison for the Titan. This is a chess piece, 280 defense, offering 64 intellect or 65 discipline. And this is the exotic that makes you evade in mid air. I know they nerfed this recently, you used to be able to dodge twice in mid air, and it was just a bit of pain in the ass catching them Titans coming from above. But now they've nerfed it so you can only do it once per cooldown. I think there's a three second cooldown, I'm not even sure. But yeah, it's still an exotic at the end of the day for the time, which is pretty useful in a lot of circumstances. So if you ain't got it, definitely buy the bad boy. Okay, so for the hunter, we've got the mask of the third man. Uh, this is a helmet offering 73 intellect. Art blade attack uses less super energy. With the recent nerf to blade dancers, and when using that blade dancer, when people swipe to get closer to you, that drains a lot or a major portion of the actual super energy. Does this make that last longer? I'm not even certain. But still, if it's one you're missing, a must buy. For the Warlock, we've got the Apotheosis Veil. This offering 80 intellect, immediate health, melee and grenade regeneration and activating your super, which I suppose in a lot of circumstances, this does come in very handy indeed. Weapon of the week, we have the Bad Juju. Now, Iron Banner's been here now for almost three or four days. Um, I've been going through a lot of weapons, and I actually started using this thing last night. And it is an amazing weapon for PvP. It really is. I mean, a lot of people talk about it, but it goes under the radar because people use the last word. They mean our multi-tool. But the Bad Juju is a great, great weapon. It really is. I actually do believe as well it's got one of the fastest time to kills of any PvP weapon in the game. So, yes, definitely a buy. I mean, if you've got a Strange Coin spare, buy it, try it out. You may absolutely fall in love with it like I have. Okay, so we also have a Helmet Legacy Engram. Don't forget guys, this will only give you year one helmets. None of them year two bad boys. So unless you need a certain year one helmet, do not purchase this. And that is it people, that's the stash for the 1st of July 2016. Again, I apologise about my voice. It's fucking killing to speak. But I hope you enjoyed the video. Do drop a like, I do appreciate the support. And I'll catch you guys on that next one. Always in the wrong, knowing where we stand, but you and I will carry on, we never get it right, left in the dark. 